shape are you in? Because we've only just seen a little bit of Nets practice there. No, oh, yeah, I feel pretty good. Uh, obviously, I went away to Australia in the 2020, so I played a bit of outdoor cricket and stuff, so I feel in pretty good nick at the moment. Um, and obviously, look, we've got a week off now and come back and train pretty hard before before the season starts. You know, we have a few games before the season starts, practice games. Um, and I've sort of watching all the lads play and stuff is, is fantastic. Everyone looks in really good nick. But obviously, it's a little bit different playing outdoors than it is indoors, so um, it'd, be, it'd, be, it'd be really good to sort of get the lads outside, hopefully get a little bit better weather in the next couple of weeks, get outside and, and play outdoors and then and go from there. And you've been away, but during the winter, of course, Jimmy Anderson's had a lot of attention. What have you made of that? Yeah, it's both fantastic, you know. Um, obviously, the quality of bowling over the last couple of years has done fantastic. Um, and just, just, just to obviously spend a bit of time with him at Lanks, just the way he trains and stuff, and you can see him sort of improving, maturing as a person, as a cricketer. And it shows in his results. Uh, he went down to Australia and he was obviously uh, the go-to bowler there, he was the number one bowler there, um, taking crucial wickets. And the, the, the way he bowls, the way he executes his skills um, in press situations is fantastic and he's grown quite a lot as a bowler and you know, he, he deserves all the, all, all the credit he gets. Are you itching for him to come back or do you think, well, you'll get more overs anyway? No, nah, no. Nah, um, obviously, to, to have someone like Jimmy in the dressing room would be fantastic. You know, obviously, he's like, um, he'll do well for us. He'll, he'll win his games and stuff. But um, to be honest, I'm not, I'm not sure we're going to see too much of it, too, too much of him. We we'll probably see a couple of games that have been at the start of the season. But then obviously, the England start playing, and he'll be back there. You know, but to, just, to, just to have Jimmy around the dressing room and, and playing along with him, you know, you can learn so much from him, like the younger lads and myself. We can learn a lot about how he goes about doing his stuff. You know. And, and it'd be good to have him back, but I think I don't think we'll be seeing too much of him. So that being the case, with him being away, does that put more pressure on the other bowlers, such as yourself, or just the left-handers? No, not really. Um, um, I think the, the, the bowlers have been bowled with, with that in for the last couple of years. You know, I think if we can stay fit, I think we're a pretty good bowling unit. We showed that last year. Um, I think we sort of second highest bowling points last year in Championship cricket. And if we can carry on doing that, and all the bowlers stay fit, working the skills in the nets at the moment, um, I think I think we'll do pretty well. And finally, every every year pretty much we come here and start the season and then towards the end of the season it's always the same story. Can we end that albatross around the neck of the county championship? It, can this be the year, especially with being over in Liverpool? You know, I, I reckon it's a good chance of it, you know. I mean we speak about it every single year. Um and I've been here eight, nine years now and that's that's the main question that always comes up, you know. And I think so, sometimes you can almost almost think too far ahead and think, right, we want a trophy and want to do this, that and, and whatever, you know. But I think, as I touched on it before, if you just think about it here and now and do what you need to do just to win maybe the next game, I don't think we'll be too far wrong. Too far, right? We won't go too far wrong. Obviously, playing at Liverpool, and I said that, it's a result wicket. Every time we played there, we've got a result. Um, and if we can use that to our advantage, we've played there, so we know them conditions better than any other county. And if we can use that to our advantage and ball, <coughs> we know the bowling condition, the batting condition, so we can have good plans to, to sort of play against the opposition and win, win some crucial games there at Liverpool. I, th I think we've got a really good chance this year.